This is my pitch for my research proposal. To start, I would like to talk about my background as the researcher in this study. I am a high school physics teacher enrolled in an educational technology program. Throughout this program, I have learned a great deal about useful ways of incorporating technology into my teaching. One method that has intrigued me the most is the flipped classroom approach. There is extensive research regarding the flipped classroom model. Essentially, the underlying pr premise of this approach is to provide students the means to acquire content knowledge outside of the classroom and reinforce their knowledge inside of the classroom. This is in direct contrast to a traditional methods which focus on content acquisition within the classroom and practice, like homework, outside of the classroom. The seemingly simple switch allows students to progress through content acquisition at their own pace through the use of pre-recorded video lectures. This in turn frees up valuable in-class time for facil facilitating more hands-on applications of student knowledge. For my case study, I would like to evaluate the efficacy of the flipped classroom model through comparing student achievement between my traditional lecturing approach and my flipped classroom approach. I will provide my 11th and 12th grade physics students with video lectures almost identical to my in-class lectures. I will do this through the use of a video camera, my iPhone, and pre-prepared whiteboards which I will mimic as slides of a presentation. This approach is known as the one-take video lecture. It is extremely similar to the traditional lecture in that I will only go through my lecture once without the need to extensively edit my lecture utilizing different recording technologies. An advantage of this is it will make it easier for me to create these lectures which can otherwise be an extremely time-consuming process. My goal is to keep my lecture method as sim similar as possible to the traditional lecture so that I can truly compare these two methods of teaching my students. I hope to determine whether or not the flipped classroom model is an effective me means of teaching my students who come from a low-income, diverse, inner-city area. These students are almost all on free or reduced lunch and come from many different ethnic backgrounds. Uh, Utica, New York, the region in which I teach, is actually a refugee capital, so many of my students' families come from other countries. Um, as a result, they may not be as similar to other student populations, so the truth is I'd like to try and figure out what works best for my students. As all teachers know, every student population is different, and it is important to find a teaching method that works best for your students.